Hey guys, this is Dragonar219 here. Welcome to Portal. Now, this game in particular is actually the, uh, kind of like Half-Life, but it's way more different uh, than the Half-Life series. And there is Portal 1 and Portal 2, which I might do after this one and such. And, uh, I, uh, and this game in particular is actually the origin of the, the Cake is a Lie meme. So, yeah, let's get to it. Chapter 1. And this time, and this game also have a silent protagonist, just like Gordon Freeman, but much more different. You play as Shell, the female silent protagonist. She is kind of like Gordon Freeman, but way more different. Instead, instead of her, her in the Black Mesa, she is in Aperture Science Laboratories, which we are are in now. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Computer Aided Admission Center. We hope your brief detention in the relaxation vault has been a pleasant one. Excuse me. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. Before we start, however, keep in mind that although fun and learning are the primary goals of all Aperture Center activities, serious injuries may occur for your own safety and the safety of others. Please refrain from the portal will open in three, two, one. Oh. Excellent. Please proceed into the chamber lock after completing each test. First, however, note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This aperture science material prevents a patient grip, will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through it. For instance, the aperture science weighted storage cube. Please place the weighted storage cube on the 1500 megawatt aperture science heavy duty super colliding super button. Could the fit could 15 megawatt can power up power up a DeLorean time machine like Back to the Future? <laughs> uh Back to the Future reference. Kobe. Uh, ah, oh no. I missed it. Please move quickly to the chamber lock, as the effects of prolonged exposure to the button are not part of this test. Wait a minute. I think the DeLorean time machine has is powered up more than 1500 megawatt. Or less, then. Was it more or less than? I don't remember. It's been a while since I've seen that movie. You're doing very well. Please be advised that a noticeable taste of blood is not part of any test protocol, but is an unintended side effect of the Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grip, which may, in semi-rare cases, emancipate dental fillings, crowns, tooth enamel, and teeth. I'm drinking my uh, morning coffee, by the way. Got it. You are now in possession of the Aperture Science handheld portal device. With it, you can create your own portals. These interdimensional game states have proven, proven, proven to oh. be completely safe. The device, however, has not. Do not touch the operational end of the device. Do not look directly at the operational <laughs> end of the device. Do not submerge the device in liquid, even partially. Most importantly, under no circumstances should move. Oh, whoops. So this is this is actually one the uh, first design for Shell in the first Portal game, and uh, things will and uh, her design will change uh, in later in the later game in uh, uh, later Portal games. 
recently the uh, Portal 2. I won't mind it at all. Wait. Oh. Well done. Remember, the aperture science bring your daughter to work day is the perfect time to have her tested. Ugh. Kind of itchy. Kind of itchy. I don't know why. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Once again, excellent work. As part of our required test protocol, we will not monitor the next test chamber. You will be entirely on your own. Good luck. You know, the kick is a life meme is actually, it's actually has the, uh, the, uh, in Portal, there is like a, uh, a cake. I think it's, it's like a Black Forest cake. It's really, de looks delicious to be honest. I never tried Black Forest cake, but I heard it's good. Oh, pfft. Uh, guys in the comments, is Black Forest cake is actually delicious and chocolatey? Uh. As expected, let me know. Oh, come on. Oh, there's no camera. Oh. To ensure the safe performance of all authorized activities, do not destroy vital testing apparatus. As part of a required test protocol, our previous statement suggesting that we would not monitor this chamber was an outright fabrication. Good job. As part of a required test protocol, we will stop enhancing the truth in three, two, one. Huh. Oh yeah, the hood. <laughs> Safety is one of many So the ones who's doing the voice voice narration in in this game is actually GLaDOS. The he she is like a artificial intelligence but went rogue in later game. You might know why. Warning devices are required on all mobile equipment. However, alarms and flashing hazard lights have been found to agitate. Good. Now use the aperture science on stationary scaffold to reach the chamber lock. You know, this game is pretty easy. I actually played this game before and such, and I sort of remember how to do this, kind of. Please know that we have added a consequence for failure. 
Any contact with the chamber floor will result in an unsatisfactory mark on your official testing record, followed by death. Good luck. Go. I do not want to fall fall on that. That could be sewer water or ugh. I don't know what it is. Ew. It looks really nasty. Please note that any appearance of danger is merely a device to enhance your testing experience. Mm. Center regrets to inform you that this next test is impossible. Make no attempt to solve it. Fantastic. You remain resolute and resourceful in an atmosphere of extreme pessimism. This is pretty easy to be honest. I think you got this. Yep. Momentum, a function of mass and velocity, is conserved between portals. In layman's terms, speedy thing goes in, speedy thing comes out. Yeah, I uh, learned about that in physical science. Ooh, that was trippy. I love the music in this game, by the way. Yeah. You know what, we will consider this in the next episode because I am almost out of time for this video. So thank you guys for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel, get this video some thumbs up, follow me up on Twitter, Instagram, this is DragonR219 here, signing out. Peace!